So people are always asking me, are there any secrets with the new RP sets in the school? And I thought we would dive into that a little bit today as well, guys. If you haven't already, hit the like button. Like spike it up to the heavens about two likes. And we will <laughs> we will finally have two likes on a video for the first time ever. But in this video, guys, we are going to go over on why Perkiven did not update uh, last Friday and what the heck is going on. Because I wanted to make this video last Friday, actually, because I was getting tons of comments from people like, why didn't Brookhaven update? I don't understand. And I wanted to kind of just give a re-updated, informated, like, like version on the updates when they drop and everything in between and why Brookhaven did not update and is Brookhaven even updating this Friday probably not wait what you, you're kidding right yeah I might be kidding a little bit but that be the case look at this home prop dude this is so cool right so I don't think you can actually go through the door up here which is weird but um yeah this door right here you can come out and be like hello everyone this is the, the family the family show of family stuff it's called the family stuff <laughs> And it's the best show around. But yeah, so you can do all kinds of cool stuff with this. Now, that door does get in the way from being able to go over here. But of course, we have the City Greece Home Western Empty Stage. And um, yeah, these are all really cool. My favorite is probably the Western. Not even going to lie to you guys. You can get your horses in here, start role playing Western time. There is a portal that if you go through the saloon door, you can actually go to another dimension. Uh, wow, dude, a new dimension. Um, but yeah, so that be the case. This is really cool. I'm not going to lie. Um, then we can change the curtains. Look at that. We put the curtains in. Nobody can see the Western time. The show's over. Thanks for coming out today, everyone. It was great. Wonderful. See you later. And then, yeah. boom, the show's over. But, yeah, this one's really cool because it has the general store, the bank, the jail, the saloon, the boarding house. And this was kind of like Wolfpack's way of giving us a little bit of a Western touch in Brookhaven. So... We know Brookhaven does hint towards a lot of Western ties with the Mr. Brookhaven story. Mr. Brookhaven seems to be a lot older than you would think he is. But, you know, he even shows back in time with horses and other stuff uh, regarding Mr. Brookhaven's house. And it's incredibly interesting, actually. Now to have, like, a Western roleplay, it's really a cool touch. I'm not even going to lie. Uh, we got the gel here. So, yeah, it's a cool, very cool touch to see Western Brookhaven for the first time. And I absolutely love it. But, yeah, as in terms of secrets, guys, just mem remember there's a lot of small features like this that you can press to make the RP sets over here look a lot better. Um, obviously, all this got updated from the clothing to the little makeup area. You know, you do your little makeup here. So, this is all really cool addition. Dude, I thought that red shirt with someone standing there for a second. I was like, nope, I don't know about that one. But, yeah, so uh, there is no really known secrets here other than, you know, you can interact with a lot of these RP sets in magnificent ways and then, of course, there's you're off to great places. The mountain is waiting. So, the mountain is waiting, right? So, that's interesting that's really interesting is there going to be something coming with the mountain soon in a future update maybe maybe but why didn't brookhaven update last friday that's because it was only one week after the other previous white house update guys so after the easter update went away we got the white house update which introduces a, a, a complete white house and brookhaven which was so cool and you can change it in multiple different ways for your roleplay availability and let me say guys that update was terrific i really enjoyed the white house update and had a blast playing it and looking for any other little additional secrets and seeing the red button and everything that update was fun and uh definitely a really good update you know i think when we get new estates now it's exciting because we know if there's going to be a new estate it's going to be huge and what i mean by that is it's going to be something that's big and kind of almost game breaking for brookhaven like it, it, it brings something to the table that we never seen and never imagined that brookhaven would be able to have and we've seen that clearly with the white house i didn't think we were getting a white house in brookhaven in a million years but but then we got it. So, um, what is coming next for the estates? You know, massive builds that can give us for our state game pass. I think there's going to be some really exciting things. But getting back to what I was saying, Brookhaven did not update last Friday because, uh, you know, the, the Friday before that, it received the White House update. And then a couple days after that, it received another little bug fix update. But it, there is a, a, a small chance, or actually a large chance, that Brookhaven is going to update this Friday, 10 a.m. EST Friday. So mark your calendars, guys. Early in the morning Friday, depending on where you are in the world, of course, it might be in the evening. But that is when Brookhaven is going to update. I know, like, if you're overseas in Asia, then it might be like... I don't know, 11 p.m. at night or something, almost Saturday until uh, the update comes out. But that is exciting either way, guys, because Friday we could be seeing a new Brookhaven update. Now, the reason why is because every two to three weeks, Brookhaven usually updates. Now, lately, it's been on the dot every single two weeks. Now, it is the most assuring thing ever when you're playing a Roblox experience and you know you can expect updates and you know updates are on the schedule to release 
quite often. And that's the most exciting thing ever because it allows you to kind of have a lot of hype around it and really look forward to something. And that's one of the beautiful things about Brookhaven. Every two weeks, we know we can see a content-based update. And I've seen a lot of people last Friday get their weeks a little mess, uh, mixed up. They thought that perhaps it had already been two weeks since an update, but it had only been one week. So that's a very simple and common mistake. But um, this Friday, guys, there will definitely most likely be a Brookhaven update. And if not, and if it does get pushed to three weeks, that's still not too unusual. In the past, it's been two to three weeks usually in between updates. But really, this year, it's been every two weeks, and that has been so much fun. So that means this Friday could be a new Brookhaven update. What is that update going to consist of? Well, guys... I think very much so the update could really surprise us in a lot of ways. We still got that thing on the board at the school that says, you know, head to the mountain for whatever reason, but I don't know. I don't know. Maybe it's going to be something to do with the mountain over there. You know, everybody has been talking about a volcano. What? A volcano? Now, personally, I don't feel like Brookhaven's ever going to get a volcano, but it might definitely get more natural disasters. With the ocean, you could definitely see something like a tsunami or even tornadoes getting introduced in the natural disaster side of things at Brookhaven. Now, this would obviously be pretty crazy. Now we have natural fires, earthquakes. Guys, I want to be honest. The earthquakes are super rare, though. Like, I get an earthquake quick every now and then but natural disasters are rare occurrences and they're sometimes very hard to capture in Brookhaven so if we get tornadoes I can only imagine like tornadoes would be extremely rare and something that you just wouldn't expect to see very often in Brookhaven now something along the lines of like a volcano definitely seems cool since we got this giant mountain here guys this mountain is huge with the drones now there could be something that allows you to turn this mountain into a volcano and here's what I think it would be now Brookhaven has a lot of theme packs. What is something we've not seen updated in Brookhaven in a long time? That's right, theme packs. So, that be the case, it only makes sense soon we could be seeing a new theme pack added into Brookhaven. Now, the theme pack could consist of a lot of interesting things, and I think one of them could be a volcano erupted map. So it changes this into a volcano and there's lava around all of Brookhaven and it shows a volcanic eruption. I think that is definitely a potential future theme pack that could be introduced at Brookhaven. But I don't know. You guys tell me. But yeah, Brookhaven should update this Friday and that's why it didn't update last Friday. So we just gotta kind of, you know, we just gotta wait and hope and I'm super excited about it. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.